Hello, it is March 30th. Today's goal is just to clean up the yard. But I got distracted and I want to split this boxwood that you're looking at and see if I can make two standards from it. I looked at the branches, which here I'll show you after I water it. I'm going to give it a couple seconds of rest and then I'm going to get the pots ready and then I'm going to split it. And we'll see how it does. Because if you think about it, boxwoods, they root really easily. So why wouldn't they work well with a split? So you see? It's like actually two... It looks like two tall ones. And they're kind of evenly uh, sized. So I think it will look nice on the pot. And then I can have it under my pergola once summer starts. So it will be under shade. And... Will be my little escape for the summer. So we are gonna split this. And these are just rocks when I'm digging in the garden I would find because I also landscape so I would keep it and I think they look so pretty. It just adds that rustic look. Okay so we're gonna split it and I looked and it still looks fine. I might have to prune this part off a little. It still looks fine. Uh without these branches i looked at my other bush it just did not so that's why i'm not splitting the bigger one i'm gonna split this so let me get i'm gonna get my shovel which maybe i should sharpen so this is let's see this is my spatula and this is a sharpener i got online on amazon i can link it let me water it first because I saw, um, I was trying to sharpen my Japanese blade, I mean knife, <laughs> that we got for our wedding. And I love it, so I was looking how to sharpen it, and they use water when they were sharpening it. So I do that now too. So I'm just going to do the tip. Oh, actually I should do it away from myself, right? Here, I'm going to go this way. Let's see. Okay, we're not looking back. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, please don't break. Okay. So it's definitely attached to the, the branch because I... I'm like... I can't get through. Here, let me... Try to get the yeah. Okay, I can't get through. I might need my shears. Let me see. Okay, I'm back. So got these. I'm just gonna put it down see if I can cut. Did that work? I didn't really feel. I don't think I cut anything. Okay. It's actually pretty hard. I felt something. Okay. We will you save that for a cutting? Oh, you see that? Oh, wow. Um, let me see if I can cut a little more and then I'm going to dig it up. Actually, I'm going to wait. Let me just try to dig it up around here. Uh oh. Let's see. Uh oh, I'm taking up the whole point. Let's see. Oh wow. <laughs> Hopefully I don't kill this plant just because I want another one. But you got it. Yeah. 
Yeah. Come on, let go. Why is it not letting go? Let me get my shears. So I feel it right there. It's probably easier if I dug up the whole thing, but pull it up. Oh. Okay. I'm so okay. Well, let's... Oh, you want to check out the roots? Let's check it out. I love looking at stuff like this. Here, let me wash it out with some water. If only I have rainwater. I don't. That way we can see the roots. Because <clears throat> I was checking up reasons why you should have a rain barrel, because my husband. Okay. You see that? Look at those roots. And over here, let's look side by side. I'm so excited. I think it will survive. I just need to watch it and make sure I water it. Uh, look at that. Wow. Wow. Oh, actually, it looks so pretty together but i wanted to separate it you see we'll figure out what we want to do with that but wow so i ran out of storage but i did pot them up and this one here it has roots all over this side it just roots one side and the other side had no roots so and it's shorter than this one, so I put it in a smaller pot. And this one, bigger pot, it has more roots. Thanks for watching, and if you thought the video was pretty cool, please give me a like. I will update if anything cool happens, like it's really growing, or if it's dying, which hopefully will not happen. That's it for now, and if you want to follow our garden journey, please subscribe.